Hey everybody, Isaac Grendel here. Welcome back to episode two of the Let's Play. Kind of excited about this. I think I'm going to start by cleaning up this couch. Because uh, this was kind of a joke. I really didn't want to use this. I might put some kind of furnishing in here, but it's not going to be a couch. <laughs> it's not going to be made out of the same thing as the, as the floor. Uh, so today I wanted to work on farming, which I'm very glad that we do have a... Uh, we do have some iron to do that with because we are going to get a bucket. And right now we've just got the, uh, just got wheat seeds. So go ahead and grab those and dump off a bunch of other junk. So where are we putting this thing? I do plan on having a lot of farms. So... It might be a good idea. I think originally I wanted to have them down there. This is a good excuse for us to dig up some of this uh, sand also so we can use it for glass and stuff. Let me, let me clear out some of this. And uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and connect all this stuff uh, with dirt. And start building uh, a squared off land a little bit for, for farming. So I think this is pretty much what I'm going for here. I filled all this in with with dirt and uh, I think I want to basically probably start right here and straighten that out and turn this all into farmland. Um, but I want it to be incredibly decorative. I don't want to just have, oh, this is my little patch of dirt where I grow stuff. And... Um, also, when it comes to that, I kind of, at the starter base here, I kind of don't want to really go for a bunch of redstone farms just yet. Um, I do plan on doing that kind of thing soon, uh, but I don't think I'm going to do it at the starter base. Um, I do want to have, eventually, an iron... I do want to have, eventually, an iron golem farm uh, here. Because that's just logical to to have that kind of thing. Um, but as for like massive redstone um, farms for for vegetables and stuff like that, I don't think so. I want to get some cobble. Might as well hollow out a little bit of this while I'm doing that also. curious on what we're going to run into down here. Looks like yet another. Ooh, we got some iron. That's good. Oh, I need to get some water breathing potions so bad. But I think that is enough cobble for right now. So I'm making, I believe this is the fourth crafting bench of the series so far. Oh, look who we got. We don't really need to mess with the spiders right now, I don't think. <laughs> 
Look what we got. <laughs> I will completely admit that he just scared me a lot. But this is a chance to get more free. Haha! <laughs> he got both of them in one boat. Yes. What do you got? Ooh, dripstone leaves. Did we get any emeralds when we went into that sunken ship? No. No, we did not. Oh well. Gonna ignore him for now. Back. Beast. Okay, looks like I need to extend this a little bit. Two more. That's not that big of a deal. Being chased by a skeleton. Who's an awful hit, by the way. Haha, -ha, not today, thank you. Really shouldn't be working at night as it is, but I don't learn ever. Tell me about you. Not in the mood to play right now. Might go get all the skeletons I see though, because bones would be nice. Gonna get you. Thank you. Ooh, a bow. I can shoot that four times. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna start off with that. And I want to wrap stone around it. So we got that, and I'd like to build the sugar cane off of the regular farms. Just a little bit. And I know you don't need sand to grow sugarcane. I just, I think it looks better. And again, we're going to end up doing a auto. Uh, we're going to end up doing auto farms and all that for all this. As it is eventually. But right now, I just kind of want to. I don't know. I just want to have a nice manual farm at my starter base. That's good. That's fun. All right, so I see myself eventually getting attacked by drowned, so we're probably going to have to put a fence up, but I think I'm going to run around and try to find some seeds first off. Might be a good idea. <laughs> There's wolves! I've got three bones. Lucky dice, lucky dice, lucky dice. Yay, one! Awesome, I got one dog. Hey, buddy. We're gonna get your friends later on, too, and we're gonna breed you up, and you're gonna make our place skeleton proof. Yeah. Well, I am finding next to no seeds. Oh my god, there's one. Okay. Because I've been at this for a little while. 
look, sheep. Or at least sheep remnants. God. It's one of the big reasons why I like to tame all the wolves, because if you don't, they're just going to kill all the sheep. I didn't know there were sheep this close to home. Hey, buddy. All right, well, that's going. Maybe we will go on a little bit of an adventure. Because last episode we went that way. Maybe we should go this way. All right, now that it's morning, we've got a full stack of pretty much everything. Let's grab what we have for food, which is not much. And uh, check out what is going on on the other side. Which I'm kind of excited about. We'll go ahead and give our farm a chance to grow. I've been working on some designs for a pier, and I'm, uh, I'm pretty, pretty excited about it. I'm not doing anything to organized or calculated or anything. I will be freeforming most of the stuff that I build, but I don't know, just uh, having a nice pier there just seems nice. We're gonna need a lot, a lot of wood to do that. So what do we got? Ooh, ooh, I see vines. Is that a swamp or is that a jungle? Ooh, that's neat. Oh, puffer, puffer fish, no. Bad fish, I got puffed. There he is. There's a little culprit. <laughs> oh, it is a jungle. Awesome. We're going to need some things from this jungle. Like turtles. Hey, turtles. Hey, guys. Alright, so... We can already see things that need to be added to our farm. So, ooh, fire. There must be lava over there. Such as chocolates. Maybe we'll luck out and find some melons. But I think one of the first things we need to do is get our hands on like four saplings. There's one, two, three, four. And I only had to bald two and a half trees to do it. Sweet. Let's go ahead and grab that extra chocolate. Kill the hoe, which stinks because I could really use that while working our way through the jungle. Here's our lava. There's some more chocolate. I really should have been smart and built a compass first, but... Melons! We can find our way back out to the ocean. It's not like we're going to lose it. Cool, so we can have a melon farm, too. Or a melon crop on our farm. I wonder if we'll luck out and find a, uh, find a jungle temple. Don't think so. This looks like a very tiny jungle. Poop. Oh, well, we at least got some melons. We got another type of wood, which is great. Oh, we got bamboo! And, oh, there's a parrot. Better give me some seeds. These guys can be greedy. And I know you never, ever, ever feed them chocolate. Oh my god, there's a parrot over there. And some bamboo. I'm excited. Okay, where is he? That's a chicken. There he is. I hear zombies. There he is. Alright, he's not a threat. Oh, where'd he go? Parrot. There you are. Hi, buddy. <gasps> Yay, parrot. I got a parrot. Let's get this bamboo, too, and start planting that. I'm going to take the whole thing. How rude is that? Alright, there's some more bamboo. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. We got a green parrot. It'd be so cool if we could, like, find more colors. Do you have any friends, little parrot? Huh? Do you have any friends? Hee 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 hee. Hee 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 hee. Yes. Alright, now that we're starting to feel all Swiss Family Robinson. Hey, cows! 
I'm not ready for cows yet. I, I want cows, I'm just not... I don't have a space for them, and I didn't bring my leads, because I didn't think I was going to find cows. And I don't want to carry them in a boat. Alright, looks like that might be all the parrots. I guess we should be glad that we got all these wheat seeds. Ooh, another parrot, another parrot. It's a blue one. Ooh, it's a, uh, it's a hyacinth macaw. Which are some of the harder parrots to get in real life. And looks like he's going to be the same here. But I got him. Yes, two. <laughs> I'm a pirate. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, we got a uh, ocean monument really close to home. That's uh, scurry. Ooh, I got a boat. Is this where you pirates came from? The pirate parrots? Be really nice if there's a desert nearby. And I think I see one near another boat. That's so cool. Ah, okay. Ooh, a treasure map. And I'll take that paper, too. I'll take the feathers. Ah, we're gonna take this, too. Ooh. We've even got a bottle of XP, so that's cool. Bottle O Enchanting. Not that it really gives you much. Seem to have lost a parrot. Okay. Ah, good. The chest that matters is still here. Ooh, we got another treasure map. Let's see what we got here with the treasure maps. They're probably identical. No, they're two different ones. Okay. I'm going to put these away. And one day we're just going to have to do a, a treasure map episode. There it is. Whew. Yes, another diamond. That is great. we got to find my other parrot. Oh, there he is. There he is. Hey, buddy. Okay, cool. I got both my parrots. We're good. Just a nice night, me and my parrots. Out in the ocean. Ahoy. Like a bird on a tree. I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can uh, Home sweet home together. Yeah That's where you guys live now Alright, so parrots are going to stay up here I'm going to empty my inventory. So cook off this mutton. And we might as well use this now. Doesn't really give you much as it is. start organizing our chests oh that was close <laughs> half a heart that guy just he he did what creepers do he snuck up on me I'm very curious to see what's down this river I hope this rain isn't too loud for you guys that is so cool. I'm so happy with that. Okay, so here this is. And I don't think I can actually get... Yeah. I might open this up at some point in time. Maybe put a big bridge. That'd be cool.
Ooh. There's a waterfall over here. Pretty good one, too. Look at that. That's nuts. Okay, well, let's avoid the waterfall. All I'm finding is sugar cane. This stinks. Cows. Might grab these cows on the way back. Or we might grab these cow on the way back. I only saw one. Oh, that's it. I was really hoping the river would just keep going. <gasps> Pumpkins! Pumpkins! It's another crop for our farm. You know what? We have a compass. Which means I'm not afraid to get lost. Let's go ahead and pick up our boat. See what else we can find out there in this great big world. Did I see what I think I saw? I did! Oh, it's an abandoned mine shaft. On the surface. Crafting bench number five. Bed. And we'll probably just take this with us. Okay, let's, let's see what we can see. There's a spider. Whew. This is so exciting. Death Strider 3, we got some tracks, some bread, which we're going to eat, activator rail. You know what, I'm going to go ahead and leave the tracks and uh, come back for those later. I love mine shafts so much. Don't want to mess with them. Completely leave the cave spiders alone. Hello, spider. You're not like your little cousins, so I don't mind fighting you. Oh, this is so cool. It's a big one, too. Like, looks like it goes for a while. Opens up to some caves. Good stuff, good stuff. This is exciting. We're going to have to come back here at some point and do like a complete and depth search of this place. I'm going to go out there and put a pillar up, so I'm going to collect some cobble. What? Why? What? Stop it. Nobody said they wanted to hang out with you. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and put a it's not really a beacon, but I'm going to go ahead and put like a pillar over here. So I got this idea from watching Paul Suarez Jr.'s uh, How to Survive and Thrive um, series. He, um, he likes to put pillars up to mark places of interest. So that is, that is a pretty cool, 
Pretty cool idea. Pumpkins! Pumpkins! This is also a good chance for us to just cheat and use the ooh donkey. Anyway, you uh, cheat and use the C button to to zoom since we don't have a uh... this is scary uh, since we don't have a um, um, thing. Can't remember what I was gonna say. A, t a, a spyglass yet? God, please let me hit this. Okay. Oh. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. I clenched a little bit with that one. Oh my gosh, how much coal is in this one vein? I keep thinking I get to the last one and then another one pops up behind it, like this one. Should probably start heading back home. We've gotten a lot of stuff. More stuff than I was expecting. I was really kind of just thinking, hey, let's head out and see if we can find a village, but this has been crazy. Um... I did see that huge pumpkin patch. I kind of want to head over there and swipe as many of those as possible. But yeah, we'll be able to see that for some distance. Our monolith. Our cobblestone monolith. Pumpkins. Cow. Ca cow? Where's the cow that I knew? The cow, cow disappeared. Cow, cacao, cacao, chocolate milk, cacao. What? Pumpkins. We are just getting loaded down with pumpkins today, and I am not complaining because these things sell pretty darn well when we get a, a farmer villager going. There's plenty of cows in the sea. I'll get me another sea cow. I'm just very curious, that's all. Well, there it is. Cacao? Wanna come with me, cow? Hop in the boat. There we go. This <laughs> is cow napping. Maybe we'll find a friend for you, uh, friend for you on the way home. Found more cow. Hey, this is against your will. Three more cow. Three more cow. It's kind of messed up. They're skiing. Oh, I forgot about this. Um, bear with me. not good. Alright. You guys have lost the uh, boat privilege. It's my boat. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> my boat sank! <laughs> I forgot that was even possible. Oh well, I guess we're, we're swimming the rest of the way, guys. <laughs> My boat sank. Alright, so until we get you guys all set up where you need to be, I'm going to go ahead and grab a fence post, or I guess I could make a fence post. Let's 
go ahead and just do that and that there you go oh that grew right behind me all right so we got some cows yay I don't see the uh, wandering trader anywhere. He's he's gone. The merchant is gone. All right. Well, that was fun. That was a fun little adventure. We got a lot of stuff. I'm actually really excited about that. And next time we go that way, we gotta remember to bring a uh, an iron pickaxe. Cause yeah, that was that could have been lucrative, more lucrative than it was. Um, I think that we actually have enough. Do we not? I thought we did. Yeah, no, we do. We have enough. I didn't even have to get anything else. So let's go ahead and make our iron armor. And uh, I should say, this is the last time you'll be seeing these smooth duds for a while. There you go. That's right. I'm ready for action. So we actually got a lot of animal stuff done today. That's crazy. We got two parrots. We got a dog. We got, like, I think I got four cows. There's a couple llamas here that I very well might end up keeping. Uh, <laughs> if they keep staying here. In fact, I think I'm going to go ahead and tame them. And uh, maybe I'll just go ahead and keep the llamas. Why not? Keep the wandering llamas. Make it so they don't wander no more. Do you like me? No. Nope. Do you like me? Come on. Come on. There we go. Good job. Here. You get a boat. Do you like me? He doesn't not like me. I'm so confused. He's not... He's not bucking me off or anything. He's just kind of hanging out. Um, here, you get a boat too. Till I can figure out what to do with you. Do, 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 do. Oh, we're stuck. Okay. I've got melons and pumpkins that need to be planted. That is so cool. I think I have just the right design for them to... <clears throat> okay, big day. Melons and pumpkins. Melons and pumpkins. Um, much like I said before, no auto farms when it comes to this. I uh, do have some auto farms I want to make for melons and pumpkins. But for right now, what we're going to do is uh, make some melon and pumpkins. <music> So that's our melon farm. We'll have two sets of melons. And then we're going to do the same thing. Pumpkin. Right here. be that and then I need a way to protect the stocks so what we're probably gonna look at here is that and that okay I'm I'm really just all over the darn place right now let's go ahead and get these so I really do want the Wheat to start being over here, but we should probably skip skip the line for right now. Get some oak. 
and we will build up some stuff. Actually, actually, let's forget oak and use jungle. Give it that pinkish coloration. I like that. go and maybe I'll put like lights on the inside here but this will stop anything from being able to trample on the stems but it won't stop them from growing that will be nice okay come on drop your stuff I see saplings up there I need those all right, we actually have some yield for our farm now. <laughs> awesome. Very, very cool. Next, I kind of want to go ahead and start putting the fence around here. Yes, I think the last thing that I'm planning on doing is the egg farm, but I don't want to go too nuts with it. Hey, uninvited. Spider guest, spider guest. Take it down, because you're a pest. All right, material I need to get this egg farm going. Because chickens are loud. Especially when you have them all confined in a tiny little area. We need a bucket. We need a hopper. So we are going to need a chest after all. Take one of those. Probably just unload a bunch of this junk. Replant that. Thank you. All right, where is our eggs going? I think our, I really do feel like our eggs should be closer. Um, thinking about like right here, maybe. Hmm. Let's do that. Where? <laughs> I don't have a, don't have a hopper yet. There we go. Okay, so this is the basis of an egg farm. You have a container, you have a hopper, and then we need to put chickens there. So, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to move this over just a little. Space, block, hopper. Or a barrel. So there's that. And then... Okay, I don't really have much to work with in here. Am I out of... No, I got logs right here. Stairs right here. That's pretty much everything that I'm going to need for right now. Because what I was thinking about doing was something like this, where I make like a little miniature version of my house. Just something like that. Um, if we do that, we are going to need some 
stone. Like that. And then... Let's go ahead and do this. Alright, so there's going to be where the chickens go and lay their eggs. So, we need it to be too tall, so let's go ahead and do this. And... Do we not have... Yeah, there you go. Just load my inventory up with a bunch of junk. I'm gonna do this. I don't think the baby chickens will be able to get out of there. I could very well be wrong. <laughs> okay, so let me see. Where's my. Do I have ladders here? Yes, I have ladders. that and then that's too deep so the chickens should not be able to get out of there. Do I have eggs? I don't think I have any eggs. That's what this farm is for, Brendel. I do not have any eggs, but I have pumpkin seeds I don't need anymore. Let's find some chickens. Hello one chicken. You will do. I was just kind of hoping for a breeding pair. One chicken. This chicken, oh, two chickens. You two chickens will start my empire of eggs so I can start eating pumpkin pie. Yep, come on. Look, I got double the seeds, buddy. Double the seeds. You know you're excited about the seeds. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on in. There you go. Have some seeds. Yes. Now let's see if the babies can get out of there. I don't know if they can. Can the babies get out? Does not look like it. That's awesome. That's super awesome because I could probably do that. And that. Nope, that XP is lost forever. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure I just let the baby out. Yep. All right, little baby, go on. Do what you want. I only need the adults anyway. They're already laying eggs. That is amazing. Thank you guys for being so punctual. And that goes there, there, and then that goes there. And we're going to just have to leave that the way that it is. And then when they lay eggs, all I do is open that and I throw them right in there. And eventually I get more eggs. So I have... A uh, pretty snazzy chicken coop, in my opinion. That works. I am happy with this. Alright guys, I'm pretty sure that's everything I'm doing today. I've got some other stuff i got to get done, so I'm going to get going. But uh, just to take a little overview of everything that we've got. We've, we did this... we got a lot of animals like taken care of. we got two lot. We got two llamas. I'm a little confused on where one of the llamas is at the moment. But we got two llamas. We got two parrots. We got a dog. <coughs> There's our dog. We got our chicken coop set up where we're going to be getting eggs on the regular. Uh, and as they breed up, more, uh, more eggs to be used for food and stuff. We got... 
cows. And we have a disappearing llama. I guess I didn't get that one. I guess I didn't get that one tamed as well as I thought I did. So we need to keep an eye out for a brown wandering trader llama if we're going to try to get like one of each. Um, the farms are coming along big time. I gotta. I have to express how excited I am about how how wonderful this stuff is is starting to look. And it's far from done. It, it is it is not even close to being done. Um, we are going to grow as much wheat as we can. But as other crops come in, we're going to start making it so this farm... Um, I don't know, maybe we'll alternate for a little while or something like that. But <laughs> come on, guys. Don't be silly. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm just excited to see all the stuff that's going to end up happening, how this is going to work out. The uh, the melon and pumpkin stalks are starting to look pretty good. And the house, look at our house. It's so pretty. And we got a little miniature house right next to it with chickens. This is great. We're going to actually need to have some chickens that we can eat too, though. At some point, you don't all have amnesty. Let's just get back in there and keep cycling in those eggs. They're not always a winner. Oh! Okay, no, that's not gonna work. I was like, oh, maybe we just hop up here. Nope. Nope, nope. But yeah, I like this. I like this little thing. Maybe we'll put some, maybe we'll put a little fake chimney on here. We'll put some bricks here. It'll put like a torch on top or something just to give it a little bit of a look. I don't know. It looks cute. Anyway, I am having a good time with this. Um, I'm Azek Randall. This is uh, episode two of our playthrough. And but this is day 18 and not a death. I want to celebrate every mini victory. And I think that's a pretty good mini victory is the fact that we've lived this long and no dying. But I will see you next time in this blocky world that we call home. Bye.